Here's an in interesting record that I found just the other day. It's a 10-inch Aeolian Vocalian Vertical Groove record. It's the only 10-inch uh, Aeolian Vocalian Vertical that I've ever found in my years of, coll of collecting. I have found uh, two 12-inch Verticals. Aeolian uh, Vocalian Recorded Vertical Groove records from uh, 1917 uh, to very early 1920 before going over to the uh, uh, more common lateral groove records. And this is how you're going to keep them down in the farm. But it also uh, introduces a couple of uh, strains from uh, My Barney Lies Over the Ocean and Come On Papa, which were also introduced in 1919, uh, just after the end of uh, World War I. But what makes this record particularly interesting is it's played by Daphne's band, uh, the organizer and composer of which was was for Daphne. Um, and this is a African-American band, uh, which was uh, something that was very rare in the 19-teens. Uh, the only other one I can think of at that time was James Reese Europe's um, Hellfighters band who recorded uh, very briefly in 1919, right after the war. But uh, here is Ford Dabney's band uh, playing How You Gonna Keep Them Down on the Farm. So let me put that on for you now. It's a vertical groove recording, so I'm going to be playing this on the uh, Path A Solophone, obviously with the vertical groove setting.
That was Daphne's band from uh, 1919 playing How You Gonna Keep Them Down on the Farm. Also introducing um, segments from My Barney Lies Over the Ocean and Come On Papa. Before Dabney, incidentally, also collaborated with the great uh, James Reese Europe in the 19-teens on several of Flo Ziegfeld's productions. And um, before Dabney also wrote the great, uh, what was to become a great jazz classic, Shine, and also uh, wrote Castle Walk. <laughs> 